morning everyone, it's Annie here and I've got my little Sophie with me today, Sophie Pearl, who is the um, Serenity Sculpt by Laura Lee Eagles and she's got a little um, little lamb, a little stiff lamb actually, playing a little tune to her at the moment, so sweet. But I'm going to do a changing video today, um, I thought I'd give her a change. At the moment she's in um, a Sarah Louise little dress and she's wearing these beautiful little booties I'll take them off so you can see that I got at the Dole show they're absolutely really exquisite they're so lovely so but I'm going to change her into something um, warm and cosy because it um, snowed last night and it's very very cold today here um, so I thought I'd make her all nice and cosy um, yeah, so yesterday I had a very busy day. Um, I put all the Christmas decorations up yesterday. Um, I've never ever put them up this early before. It's usually, I usually put them up about two weeks before Christmas. Whoops, oh, the little lamb's gone for a swanny over the bed, other side of the bed, but never mind. Um, yeah, so, uh, because obviously um, I'm going to the hospital and I'm not sure when that's going to be um, uh, and obviously you won't be able to do it when I come home so I thought I'd get them all up this weekend um, I think Ken might be going up to see his family in Blackpool next weekend so um, obviously that's out because I can't lift all the stuff down from the loft and things so he gets up in the loft and gets it all down um, so we did that yesterday um, I did the tree and Ken, what did he do? <laughs> well, he um, he's actually an aircraft engineer and he um, his hobby is um, flight simulator on the computer and I'm not sure where he flew to yesterday but he was on the computer quite a lot yesterday playing, doing that so um, he enjoyed himself while I was... He did do a hoover up for me though, bless him, he did all the stairs and the... Um, the lounge for me once I'd uh, put the tree up because there were bits everywhere. So anyway, I'm going to put Sophie in this little uh, onesie today, which um, she actually came in when I when she arrived. She was wearing this when she came, so she's not worn it again since. So I thought I'd put her in that today. Um, don't want to do her hair again today, so I'm trying to be careful with her hair. Uh, what else? Um, Uh, what else, what else, what else can I talk about? I finished my crib, my new crib for my mum. Um, my early Christmas present, and that's done. I'll show you that in a minute if I can. Um, and I took my Moses basket that, they, that the girls were in before I did the crib. I took that over to mum on Friday. And she loves it. She put her babies in there. Um... Yeah, she, she put her babies in there and she said, you know, it's so nice, she said, having them together rather than just one. Cause she had a little tiny doll's pram, but only one would fit in there. Um, and Emily was the only one. Rosie didn't fit in at all because Rosie's is quite big compared to um, Emily. So, uh, yeah. And then we're going to put these little leggings on, which are um, cable knit leggings. They're not hand knitted, they're only shop bought ones but so we're going to put those on um, and Ken's going to the cinema this afternoon with um, my stepdaughter they're going to go and see um, The Mockingjay so they're looking forward to that uh, Letitia's got a new boyfriend at the moment, so she's like, oh, um, it's a, well, first proper boyfriend, I think. So she spent um, yesterday with him in the afternoon, and then she went to work in the evening. She works in a hotel doing waitressing, um, and it was the first time she had to drive back in the snow, and I was, obviously, me and Ken were both concerned, but we thought, well... You know, she's got to do it at some point. We just told her how to drive properly. I'm just going to show you these shoes. 
in the snow and ice so we told her how to drive you know don't brake hard and if you start to skid take your foot off the brake and things like that so she was fine so very proud of her so these little shoes I don't know where I got them from um where are they from let's see if I can tell TU where's that from oh, I'm trying to think is that test is it Tesco's I'm not sure I'm not sure, but they are really lovely and they fit perfectly. Oh, they look so sweet. Oh, don't they look sweet on you? And the little pussy cats to match her little onesie. And I'm going to put a little, nice little cardigan on there as well to keep her extra warm and cosy because it is very cold today. Um, I'm going to write Christmas cards today and get them done. It's probably something I could do when I come home from hospital, actually, but I just don't want to be worrying about it, so I'm going to get it all done. Um, and I'm back to work tomorrow, Ugh, which I'm not looking forward to. Um, for those of you who don't know, I work for a bank, or a large bank, and I deal with complaints <laughs> for the bank. Um, and I, can't, I, I mean, I love looking after customers and I love, um, you know, making things right for them. And, um, you know, because when we do make a mistake, we like to, uh, you know, to say, yes, we've made a mistake. We'll put it right. And this is what we obviously compensate as well. Um, I'm not sure I like that cardigan on there, actually, with that. I think it looks too big. Yeah, so... Um, I'm just going to change her card because I'm not keen on that one. I think it looks too big. Uh, yeah, so I'm back to work tomorrow. And, um, you know, I've had some time off because of um, st uh, stress and anxiety. So um, it's going to be um, a busy day tomorrow. I've probably got a, um, hundreds and hundreds of emails. Um, probably all be, you know, the long ones. So I can just delete most of them. Um, but... I need to get up to date with what's been going on, um, things like that. But the thing of it is, I'm only going to be back probably a few weeks and then I'll be off again. So it's not really that good. Um, but hey ho. Uh, looking forward to seeing um, the next episode of Walking Dead. I don't know if any of you guys watch that. I know Chris, you know, who watches that? Uh, I can't remember now who watches somebody on the, one of the channels watches it um but i still i'm still not sure what's happened to glenn if you watch it um glenn was a character from the beginning and I'm, we're not really sure what's happened to him at the moment ken thinks he's survived but i don't know quite know how he would have done there she is look at her and i'm gonna put that little dummy on her i think does that look okay she's so beautiful so that's how, yeah, that cardigan fits. This is one that I knitted actually, so that cardigan fits a lot better. It's, um, I think, it's probably uh, just newborn, whereas the other one I think is uh, zero to three months. Um, it drowns her a little bit. So there she is. Um, and I'll just show you the new crib that I made. Well, I didn't make the crib, I made um, all the bedding to go in it. Um, well, I adapted it actually from it's a, a dormer um, design and I bought the quilt and uh, some fitted sheets a couple of fitted sheets um, and just cut it all up really <laughs> put some sort of extra um, this lace is beautiful I got that in um, the Lake District so it's pretty and then I've got the skirt underneath there and I am get um, I have got um, a canopy coming um, so that will go sort of uh such so in the middle so it go either side of them so yeah so um anyway that's it for today just thought i'd do a, a little video because i probably won't do another one till next sun uh, next weekend now and um, being back at work i'll go in the dark and come home in the dark <laughs> so i hope you enjoyed the video um give it a thumbs up if you did and i'll see you all soon take care